Hello, my name is MJ Connell. I'm an up-and-coming journalist, and I'm here to bring you the most true facts about Babe Ruth's visit to Spring Hill College. Babe Ruth came to Spring Hill in 1924. So, you know, coming to Mobile, Alabama. What are you doing all the way down here, babe? The scrimmage between the New York Yankees and the Spring Hill Badgers is about to begin. Everyone's like, where's this Babe Ruth guy? So up comes to the plate. The announcer pronounces, and now up to bat, number three, the Sultan of Swap, the great Bambino, the one, the only, Babe Ruth. And everyone, finally, their attention is grabbed to the game. Babe Ruth. That's the greatest baseball player of all time. That's the Sultan of Spot. That's the great Bambino. Let's see how this goes. At the game, Spring Hill struts out their stud pitcher, Puppy Bougier. Now, you want to wonder why a guy's name would be Puppy. See, this was his nickname. And Puppy was his nickname because he'd be out at the apartments on the weekends, getting denied by every girl, but then he would slap him with a puppy face. You know, like, so, Puppy is on the mound against the living legend, the Sultan of Swat, Babe Ruth. Staring there, facing him, looking him down with his chubby face, beer belly descending above his belt, getting ready to sucker one out of the stadium. Gives him a piping hot fastball right in there, gives him some chin music, owns the plate. 0 oh and 1. Then, suspecting a breaking ball, Puppy throws a curveball to catch the roof off guard. Down 0 2 in the count. All of a sudden, the crowd's gasping, reacting. This is the Bambino. This is why we're here. Everything those reporters are telling us, he's the greatest baseball player. He's down 0 2 to Puppy Bourget at Spring Hill. Sultan hears them, whispers to himself, I ain't let myself get no kid, the best of me. Next thing you know, Puppy tries to throw his sloppiest, slurmiest breaking ball that he can throw. And Ruth takes one strong whiff on <laughs> Smacks it, sails far over the, over the wall, way past the golf course, and smashes through the windshield of a Ford buggy on Dolphin Street. So, he was an orphan, became a great baseball player, and for some reason came to Spring Hill to play baseball. True story. Thank you.